everyone, and welcome to yet another episode of The Sandbox. This is our adventure crafting survival multiplayer game stream series. Every Thursday we like to get cozy and just have a good time with friends. Joining us as always is Will Crosby. Oh, I, I, I say it again, I didn't unmute you. That's me! Okay, now I'm gonna mute you. Bye, Will. Bye. Uh, also, also joining us is Zach Crosby. Hey! And joining us is me, Ian Gibson. Uh, this week we're going to be playing some more of... I say some more, but it is the penultimate episode. It's going to be ending soon. We're going to be playing Sky Factory 4, the excellent Minecraft mod pack. Let's hit that transition. There we go. Let's get that desktop audio up. There we go. Gentlemen, how's it been? I unfortunately missed last week's stream, so how are things doing? Uh, we're good. We're almost got fusion reactor power. I think I have a fusion reactor up and running, though. You got a dumb fusion reactor up and running. Yeah, dumb. Right, let's go. Smart so I actually um, need your help. I know it's running, but for some reason I can't actually pull power off of it. It's very weird. Um, so this is my fusion reactor, which took me much shorter time than it did Will's. I also have a weirding gadget and I have a flux network up and running, but I don't think it's actually pulling power. I'm also at 2595 FE per tick. Okay, so that's a tiny bit more than my vision reactor. Yes, but I, it's very easy to get it higher than that. Um, no, I, I wasn't saying that as a flex. I just meant. No, no, I know. And I just, I wasn't going to expand it more until I actually figure out the power. So. The Was there a reason you built it in the twilight? Yeah, because that's just where I found a close singularity. But because of the weirding gadget and the flux network, it's pulling power anyways. Are you okay over there? Um, <laughs> I'm, I'm over with. How, how do I get out of this? It didn't launch you out? Yeah, it should launch you out. Oh, Wait, there we go. Ian, is that why you texted me the other day that you were stuck? Yeah, I, I actually got sucked into it, and it crashed me. And when I came back in it, I was stuck inside of it, running at, this is not an exaggeration, about one frame per minute. Oh, and, okay, now I'm stuck in it again. No, I mean, like, I was, like, literally a frame per minute. It was bad. That's um, also easy. I'm not sure if Zach has explained, but both Zach and I are cyborgs now, androids. Oh, so am I. Oh, you became one as well? Yeah, apparently there's some update you can do as an Android to also um, remove the singularity's pull on you. Oh. Yeah, nice. I'm, I don't really care about the food because now we have a whole bunch of s'mores, so. Yeah, I, I just, I so I have a infinite Paxel, so I can vein mine forever. Oh, that's I don't really need nice. food and I have that. So I go into the Twilight Forest, click on a piece of stone, and hold it down for like 30 seconds, and it yeah. mines the entire thing. Okay, so enough about my fusion. Let's go check out what you guys have done. Mine is running, and I can very easily make it bigger. I just, I don't think I'm pulling power, which is very weird. As soon as I figure out how to pull power, we're good. Um, so let's check out your fusion reactor. Yeah, I just asked, like, minutes? Or like 10 seconds before you started yeah. your intro, I deleted everything that is surrounding my... Oh, uh, yeah, you did. Why did you... Side, because you vein mined it? I vein mined it. I made sure it was not connected. Here. And somehow... Here. I think sometimes there's a proximity vein mine. Yeah, I have seen it do diagonal before. So that's what happened. Okay, so you need some time. Uh, no, it's, it's pretty much, Let me uh, Let Zach, me if you want to switch that to export on the battery and also import. So this is yeah. Ethereum, the, the farm we've got going on, but honestly, we don't really need that that much. It um, helps us get enough, enough lithium. And you, oh, okay. Oh. This is the fission reactor farm, which is providing enough power to, uh, the battery. And you need this battery to basically jumpstart the fusion reactor, right? Yeah, just a little bit. Yeah. Uh, it was mostly because the um, 
we were just charging the batteries offline. So instead of waiting, it was trying oh, to give it yeah. much. Because you could have fed uh, it slowly, but now you just want to dump yeah. it, right? Okay. Okay, Zach, is that stuff hooked up? Yeah, it is. Okay, I'm going to try do this. You, do you need more of these infinite water sources on every corner? Because you're missing it in uh, every corner. No, 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 no. Uh, w w that's for after. Oh. We want to start cooling it after. Okay. okay so I, want, I need to get it more went green. batteries turned on. Okay. I see the core. Out of signal and flux duct is the problem. I um, I was thought I was, I was gonna try and do something good and make a automated cryo flux duct, which is I think the top tier. But we don't have any blizz, and I couldn't find any blizz, which you need at a bare minimum to start the automated process. Exactly. This um, is fairly uh. The temperature change isn't going crazy. Oh, really? Yeah. I think that was a effect of us having the, those active coolers on before it started. Yeah. So Makes it's sense. going up. The last time we did this, it was the if you hover over the green thing filling up, Ian, it says temperature change. That was like jumping like crazy. Oh, actually, now it's starting to do that. But it was Wait, going what? like from negative 800 to 1,000. I don't see a green thing filling up. Uh, if you click on this middle reactor. Oh, okay. Now I got it. Yeah, now the temp's going up. Yeah, you see, but if you hover over the green, you see the temperature change is going crazy. Yeah. No idea why it's doing that. K per T. I mean, it is per tick. So if they haven't yeah. introduced a smoothing algorithm, then you would see it fluctuate weirdly. Uh, Zach, is it possible for you to get more? Uh, what do you need? Um, resident flux duct? Yeah. Give me about 60 um, minutes. I'm going to go over here and I'm going to show you guys what I did. This was two weeks ago. I was thinking about food and I found this s'more s'more ingot, which is a lot. It's basically the best food in the game as far as I can tell. Um, and I decided to automate it. So I had to build this entire corner which I don't know if you guys check this, it's insane. I had to make graham crackers, milk chocolate, and marshmallows from scratch. And marshmallows was like having to make molten gelatin and then into an ingot former. So like all these like 20, 30 machines over here is just for making s'mores. Um, it's pretty cool though. I'm glad we did it because now we have, let's see how many we got. Although now we're all androids and we don't need food anymore. But we had 504 more s'more double sming it, which is an insane amount. Jeez. Pretty proud of that. Um, I also have this casting basin over here that I was trying to, like, make it easier for you to just come over and dump some amber or whatever you need to smelt in here as one-off smelting. But I couldn't get it working. Um, and then I built a, a fusion reactor before Will did. That's pretty much it. Yeah. I mean, that's not true. Mine's been built for like a week and a half. It hasn't been yeah, turned it... on. Yeah. See, mine's mine's turned on. Um. But well, you said the word built. I built mine far before yours. Oh, sure you did. I think built implies that you got it running. That's not true. I think it is because you can build it badly so that it won't work, and I would say that doesn't qualify as building. I built a car. It doesn't run, but it's still a car. I wouldn't call that a car, then. Does uh, a car have to run in order to be a car? What if it's a broken-down car? Is it no longer a car? Zach, you're, you know more about androids. Do you know if there's an android update to prevent me from being pulled into the singularity or one that sounds like I that? Think it's, I think it's Android Oreo. Oreo? Android Oreo. Let me see what the android station has. You know how they name their things, different things? Android. I got a teleporter. Uh, that's a bad joke. Bad oh, joke. Bad joke. Uh, yes, there's internal space-time equalizer that negates the gravitational effects of gravitational anomalies. Yes. Okay, I need I need one of those eventually. Because right now I just kind of have to cower against the side of it so that it prevents me from pulling pulling me in. Yeah. Okay, so I have a flux plug. Let me 
put this flux plug on top. Oh, you know what we should do? Oh, no. Fuck. Oops. That's my PG-13 word. <laughs> the... I <Did> accidentally... <laughs> I accidentally threw something out of my inventory and the singularity just immediately sucked it up. So um, now I have to go make another so one. So the in, the Paxil I have took me about, I so I've only made three of them. The first yeah. one I made took me about an hour to make. Wow. And within a day, I hit Q by accident and threw it into the void. Q, that's, that's the one that I don't know about. That always messes me up. And then I made two more and so far, I have not lost it. Zach has the other one. I think Yay. we're at Eye of, Eye of Ender. We're at a, we have a we have a Blaze Bro, don't we? Zach, this is going so there much smoother than last time. Yeah. Oh, it's great. The last time this happened, it, we got to 7,600 out of 8,000 to start it, and everything just started blinking red and green, and it was... It was the weirdest thing. That's what's going to happen this time, though, right? No. And I haven't even hooked up to Zach's flux duck. To... Um, you, do I need to keep making tough alloy? Yes. Uh, No, actually, not really. Okay. I'm done. Yeah, you can so this is the uh, penultimate. I think we need to talk about what we're planning to do to cap this off. I think it's definitely kill the dragon, but I feel like we can do that pretty easily. I think it's definitely turn on your reactor. Um, anything else I'm missing? Um, I did make no, a bacon singularity, it. but that, that wasn't that crazy. Is there anything bonkers in the achievements that we kind of want to hit? <gasps> oh. oh, what was that? Whoa, oh, oh no. That was server lag. Yeah. Okay, hey, before, you do, before you do anything with the reactor, um, just let me know because I would like to catch it. It is at 34%. I'll warn you at 90%. The thing you'll be able to see is the plasma turning on. Um... So I was trying to vein mine this uh, signal and flux duct, and, and instead you... I, it broke through, but the server lagged, and then I vein mined all the ground. Hey, maybe don't vein mine, because <laughs> it sounds like you ain't great at it. No, it was a, a glitch. Um. Okay, let me see. What was that called? The, but with my uh, building gadget. Do you remember what that was called, um, Zach, for the Android? Uh, it's the gravitational anomaly. You need a space-time equalizer. <clears throat> so uh, we need space-time equalizer. We have almost everything we need. Except just, for uh, space-time equalizer. Yeah. Oh, I. Oh, yeah, yeah. Those are easy to build. I built a bunch of this. I got hey, Ian, you want to see something cool? Uh, one second, baby boy. Let me just go start a machine real quick. And then I'll come over and look. Because it's, it's going to take a little while to build this anyways. Okay. Actually, you know what? Um, yeah, sure, I'll come look. I think I have everything. Yeah, okay, I'm coming, baby boy. Okay, I'm over here. I'm here. Okay, look at the so, fusion reactor. Looking at it. Uh, wow. Did it, did it work? Did you try to vein mine it? No, no, no. I, I mean, I should have made... I don't know. Why is the server lagging for me so much? It's not lagging for me. I mean, it's a little chunky, but... It's also a creeper. Up there. Bye, creeper. Here. I don't know why I do can't you want me to... do it. What if I vein mine these electromagnets? No, no, no. Do not do that. I will... <laughs> it will kill you. Yeah, yeah. Huh, never mind. Go away. I can't I can't seem to do it. My building gadget is no longer working. Is it not hey, well, charged? There's a like eighty resonant flux duct in there. Oh, in the computer. You're the best little boy I've ever met. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. So Sorry. 
Okay. Space yeah, weird, time like, equalizer. I said it didn't say daddy. No, but you, I could tell you wanted to. I uh, yeah, I really did. They were at forty six percent. So Zach, real quick, I just have to hold the space time equalizer in my inventory in order to do this, or where do yeah, I it's put gonna, it? It has to be in in your inventory. So you need to upgrade. Do you see uh, up at the top right? There's uh, there's loom overclocking that goes to high jump that goes to internal in, inertial dampeners, and then space time equalizer up at the top. Oh, you know what? It's confusing me. These arrows are just like in the wrong order. Do you notice yeah. that? Yep. It's kind of annoying. Okay. So I have, but now I don't have XP. Don't we have something that lets you consume XP? Yeah. Any, any matter, any over, overworldian or hellish or extraterrestrial. Uh, one of them gives 30 per. Really? Yeah. The overworld only gives 10. Oh yeah. Twilight gives you 30. Yeah. I ate a bunch of that. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. And then I shift. Hold down shift. So. Got it. Do you have any more of those space time equalizers? Um, I don't, but the recipe is pretty easy. And down underneath the s'more factory is the inscriber you need to make the Mark II. Oh, cool. it's working sense. if you want to come see the thing I was going to show you. Okay, one second. Let me just finish consuming all this stuff before I forget to do it. Okay. All right, I'm coming. Okay, do it. Boop. Whoa. Oh, that's your blueprint? Yeah. Your thing or it's is my um, building gadget. It's very, very handy. It has a build to me option, which is, I think, its best feature. So you just stand far away from something and it builds a straight line to you. That's pretty cool. That's it, I built that tower with it, which I have yet to finish. Okay, we are at 54%, everybody. Why is this going so well? I don't know. It's, it's starting to do that negative number thing. Yeah. But let me check with my multimeter. We're still getting hundred and something per tick but i wanted to hook up your stuff back to it and i also i could drain uh ian's singularity what do you mean by drain it well this quantum compressor you have with a bacon singularity has ten thousand oh. fe sitting in it yeah yeah or 10 million what? is it is producing there... that it's or is that just what's in there that's well what's it at right now 10 million Oh, no, no, no. So if you open it up, you see it's at 9755 out of 10,000. Uh, so once it's done with that, it will produce a bacon singularity. But if you hook up to this, hook up to this upgradable culinary gen, it has 7.5 million fuel buffer. Gotcha. Because I, I put the singularity in there. So basically, you're going to have a, you're gonna have a new singularity exactly. soon, and you're already going to have that one. Okay, so let me... Cool, okay. So now, I, I just, I really want to figure out how to pull power from my singularity because it's, or my, my gravitational, actually, I don't know what it is called because it, apparently it's just like a broken way to get power. Like it's easy to get power from it. Yeah, I didn't realize that was an option. The mods. Oh, shoot. Yeah, it's just, it's just, I have the network set up. It has that in there. Okay, we're can, can we do something? Can we do something? I'm going to put a flux point somewhere that feeds into your reactor, and let's see if it dumps from my anomaly. Yeah, go for it. You can stick it right on top here. Okay. I also have a multimeter, Ian. So, so if you, you just want to put it on a piece of wire, I can just check that wire. Like if you put on... So that's hooked so you... up. Does that pull anything? Let me go check the other side. 
I don't think it's also, pulling anything. I think it's dumping what I have into it. Into my side? Yeah. But there's not really anything on Yeah, this is output zero RF per tick. Yeah. Oh, you know what? I may have... S yeah, I put the wrong thing over here. So let me put the right thing. Okay. Oh, yeah, there we go. Plus 25 KRF per tick. You see that? Yeah, you're taking minus 25 from me. I Is that right, though? Yeah, yeah that's the, not an output. That's. I know, but the plug is supposed to be... The plug is supposed to be the output according to the description in the uh, in the JEI. Do I have it backwards? Maybe unless see the yeah this is your plug is negative twenty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your flux point is output. Your flux plug is input. One uh, no, but I'm yeah exactly. And I want to put a flux plug here to pull energy out of this into the network. And the flux I think plug it's the says, other way around. That's weird. If you, okay. Yeah, if you if you right click it and go to your yeah. network connections, you see flux point is output negative twenty five and flux plug is input twenty five. Okay. All right. So, Will, I'm going to come change it on your side. See, this is literally the only thing that's preventing me from getting it working is because in JEI the description is opposite. It says plug is for adding We're to 74%. the network. Seventy four percent. Okay. So let me. I'm watching the levels right now. Okay, that's off. I'm now gonna add a plug. Yeah, nothing, right? Yeah, nothing. Yeah, nothing. And there's a point on that side, right, Zach? Yep. See, that's the thing I don't understand. Because the thing- so it's Why don't you try, can you switch it the other way again? Sorry. I just wanna check the levels yeah. while you're doing it. So I'm going to put a plug on this side, on the reactor. Taking off the point, I put a plug. The plug is now connected to the network. Okay, and then on your side, you want me to put a point down, Will? Yeah, like you had before. Yeah, because I know these plugs and points are working. I'm because looking I at the average. Uh, yeah, you're sucking away from me right now. The so I was at is... plus, yeah, you're taking about 25,000 RF. From me and now we're should be going back up are you on are you on your own power network yeah all right i'm gonna sap from elsewhere then yeah take off a of zach stuff and then well i'll take off from my bacon yeah, yeah yeah that's what i mean yeah you like killed my uh we're at 75 percent by the way so i'm gonna put a point here oh no i'm losing power what did what is happening i'm i'm off your network so maybe i, I do are. need to so the thing that they were talking about was how you have to add power to the reactor to jump start it but i thought i was already there i thought i'd already done that Oh, you're hurting me a lot. What is happening? I'm not on your network, though. I uh, know. I, I, you, you, you took so much from my network. Oh well, let me just. Say uh, the the battery might be dead. The battery is dead, but I should still be making enough to power this. Thing. I'm going down. Yeah. Um, can we hook this into your network? My network? No, sorry, I'm talking to Zach. Mine's, I think it already is. No, I just grabbed it here. But look, if you use a multimeter on this, it says zero. You have a multimeter? I want to make a multimeter. Yeah, they're yeah. very helpful. So, look, is it, is this hooked into the right thing? I was I was I had it already hooked into into charging the battery, so it's probably 
scare. Let me kill it charging into oh, the battery. Oh, okay, yeah, kill that. See, I was hoping we could use my reactor to jumpstart your reactor, which I think is possible once we figure out this whole power thing. And you've got a chunk loader in the twilight? Yes, so it stays on. Okay. I the think chunk what loader's gonna... on? It's on, yeah. Okay, okay. So basically, once I get mine, I think you have to feed enough power in it to stabilize, and then it's good from there. And then you literally just take stacks of like diamonds or emeralds. You just throw them into the singularity, and it it adds so much power to it. So you just stand there dumping ch stacks, and the power increases. Like people were saying, they got up to like seventy million FE per tick. Whew. So Zach, the yeah. oh. Geez. Batteries just went off. Um, okay, my five second average. Okay, you're adding 20,000. Oh, but I wonder if your bioreactors are sucking it somewhere else. Might be. I'm going to disconnect them over here. I wish there was like a power switch so you could say like does this do something is that is if i hit this one does this disconnect it what are you doing i'm over by your generators oh i was just gonna can we cut them off from everything except feeding yeah me i just don't know where to cut no, i just cut everywhere Okay. Oh, no, right. fell off. Perfect. Yeah, we're losing power to the now. Oh, wait, we're back a little bit. Okay. I'm just very confused by this flux network because I thought I had it working. I'm just confused because I thought I had enough power to turn all these magnets on. Yeah, I don't understand why the flux point's not. Do you want to try it real quick? Um, I'll yeah, well, you can keep trying it. My, my fusion reactor is down for the count right now. Well, I mean, I'll just put a plug here on this culinary gen. I'll delete the one on, the, on my reactor, and we'll put a point on your reactor and see if it's drawing power. That makes sense? Yeah. I just don't... I'm so confused. I have 27,000... I should only require 19,000. Okay, all right. So I have a plug on the culinary. I'm gonna put a point on your network. Thought I did okay. the math right. Okay, I'm coming over now. I'm gonna drop it on. You ready? Yeah. I don't know if I have to attach it to a wire. Let's try a wire. Oh, okay. 85, 86. Nope, then it went then it went down to nothing. Is it pulling it's spiked. or oh everything's powering now? Yeah, it spiked hard. Spiked it, good or it, bad? I wonder if it instantly drew everything. It's still it going spiked. down. Yeah, it spiked good. Yeah, it's still pulling some. It had a huge it's got a fuel buffer that it's pulling from. Okay, so, so that we is... know this is right. Yeah, so basically it's plug to add to the network, point to pull from the network. 
So maybe go attach the other one. So this is right. So you can leave this here. Okay. By the way, that culinary gen isn't the only thing. It's pulling from everything connected to that culinary gen, I'm assuming. So maybe... Maybe. Okay, so maybe the negative means negative out from the output. As in, that's what it's pulling from the network. It is pulling ADRF from the network. I think is what it's saying. Yeah. And then the flux plug is showing plus 80. As in, it's adding 80 to the network. Yeah, okay, it must so be. if you can watch it, I'm going to go drop a, a point on mine. Drop a deuce. Because that was kind of my hope was that I would run the joke of like, I already built a work confusion reactor before you did, but then we would actually use this to jumpstart yours. Right. Okay, here we go. Point is going on and it's connected. Nothing, right? Nothing. Yeah, I don't know, it's kind of weird. Yeah, I'm still going down. All right, well, I'm just gonna throw a bunch of stuff in here. Let's see what happens. I'm gonna research this. The flux stuff? Yeah. Uh, research the reactor too. Yeah, for sure. So, so I just threw a bunch of stacks of diamond in there and I already increased my power output by 30%. Yikes. Yeah, we're still at negative 80 here. RF. When you did it before, it was negative 25K. Yeah, I gotta let my dog in, be right back. Bye. Okay. Are you chewing into the microphone again? Oh, sorry. That was not on purpose. Oh. How I, dare you? I was okay. drinking and some ice went into my mouth. Okay, so I'm trying to think um, alternate power sources. Is my bacon done? Because that'll give you another singularity, which drained pretty quickly, but... My singularity's almost done. I don't know if it's going to be done by the end of the stream. What about other power sources? <clears throat> I mean, these... Fission reactors should be enough. I don't know why they're not. I'm back. So... Oh, and your thing's it... back up to 17 million. Wait, did I, did I disconnect it... the wrong one? Yeah, is it because they're not connected or the flux stuck isn't oh, good enough? Oh, I made a bad decision over here. What'd you do? I just disconnected the wrong thing. This should actually be going back up now. Yeah, we're going back up. But not by much. And which one are you looking at? We're slowly going down. The temperature change one. So what? what's just described to me and for uh, our zero viewers, what exactly do we have to do to get this running? And I'm we looking at more the screen. power into this into this machine. And right now it's showing zero. So right now all the electromagnetics are being powered, but we need power to go into the fusion core. Okay. We need enough power to heat up the core to 8,000 kilokil or 8,000 okay. kilokilos. And how are you telling? Are you just running a multimeter? Uh, if so, if you click on this fusion reactor, yes, you'll see the temperature change. That's kind of yes. how I'm monitoring it, and it's currently going down. And what does that mean? It means it's we at don't least have a, power. We have enough power. So since it's not red, we have enough power to power all the magnets. But we do uh -huh. not have enough power to power the core. Okay. Man, I really wish we could get mine working because that would give you that power immediately. What's another way of doing energy cross dimension? Isn't there another way? Oof, I don't know. I have no idea. Oh boy. I wish I could Google it, but I can't because I'm streaming. I feel like there was at oh. least one other way. Oh, this is actually helping. Okay. What if we, um, 
I'm gonna see if... I've seen people put batteries on top of my reactor and have them charged instantly. Yeah, the problem is picking those up. Yeah, but we could hook them all together, right? Yeah. So let me see if I can at least do that. Oh, yeah, see that? Oh, well, I pulled that from the network, I think. Zach, how much is in this lithium ion battery? Uh, there's probably nothing. Probably all got drained. Oh, yeah, there's nothing. I just checked it with the multimeter. Do I have another flux plug? I do. Oh, we don't have. So. One of my reactors turn off. Okay, let's see what I can do. Let's see what we can do here, folks. Okay, let's see. Let's see, let's see. I'm going to put this battery on top. Oh, and it charges. So I put one of those um, energy batteries on top of my reactor and it charged immediately. To one, one million. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. So mine is producing power. We just need to figure out why it's how not to... adding to the flux duct? Yeah, why it's not but adding to the flux. How did you do it before? Because I think it did work before. I think it was just pulling. It was working before? It was charging? Yeah, because remember it said negative. The first time you put it on here, oh, it no, said no, negative. But I was. Oh. Per... Yeah, it's just doing it now. Oh, there it is. Yeah, you just did it. I don't. I, I've done that before. I put a plug on it. It's kind of weird. Okay, so now it's working, right? Yeah, pretty much. Okay, so now what I need to do is... But not all of my electromagnets are on. Okay, all right, I'm going to start throwing stuff. I'm going to start throwing stuff in here. This is going to be exciting. I'm just going to try and ramp it up as much as possible. You need more power, I'm assuming? Yeah. Okay. Okay gonna make stacks of diamond block yeah, so temperatures going up but not all the electromagnets are on which is probably not a good thing because when the plasma ignites it means it won't be able to be contained um <gasps> i'm gonna Shoot. can i do you want me to give you more power or no yes more as much power as you can possibly give me okay all right so for those who are watching nobody is Current mass of the gravitational anomaly is 367,000. So let me just throw some stuff in here. It's now doubled, 750,000. So my output now is still 25 KRF per T. Oh, that's because that's my max. Yeah. Okay, which freaking batteries aren't on? Why are you not on? Um, I got my bi- I made like 20 more biofuel things. Okay, perfect. Those are slowly pumping in. I just don't understand why... I think I may have maxed out the, the flux network. You get 90 in. I don't know why this is saying not all the things are powered. It should be fine. Yeah, it's okay, no longer now red. The yeah, screen's no fine. longer red. It literally just changed. It was saying... Yeah, we're going up. Okay, we're headed back oh, up. We're 120,000. Okay, how much longer do you think you need? Uh, like five minutes, maybe. Okay, good, because I think 
I think I am maxed out in terms of how, well, no wait, sorry. I'm trying to up the transfer limit. To see if, if that will work. Where's my other plug? Over there. Let me make sure all Oh well, I'll just I'll just disable the limit everywhere. Oh jeepers. I almost died. Network selection. Mm -hmm. I have disabled the limit. Let me go disable the limit on the other side. And then take a look at it and see what it's doing. Okay, I disabled the limit. Push it to the limit. So I think. Oh, I'm getting 200,000 at some points. What's the reactor at? It's at. Yeah, it's, it's at 75%. And I'm at. I'm outputting 25k RF per tick. Oh, yeah, we're going up pretty quick now. Okay, good. Because I don't know if I can go past that. I think I may have hit some sort of limit. In terms of power output per tick through flux. So temp is going up. Are we worried by that? No, temp is supposed to go up. Of what? This? Yeah. It's got to hit 8,000 kilokelvin to ignite. Okay. All right. And once that ignites, we can add the active coolers to increase its efficiency to 100%. It's actually a way of doing it with redstone, where when it hits 90%, it turns itself off. Mm -hmm. When it hits 89, it turns itself back on. It's kind of cool. That sounds cool, baby. Yeah, we're doing we're doing real good, boys. Oh, yeah, so actually. on the corners, there's the see-through electromagnets. You'll be able to see the stuff ignite. Okay, I'm staring right at it. Oh boy, we're getting there. We're at 83%. Then all of Will's dreams can come true. Let's just hope it never uh, blows up. Uh, next week. Actually, I think when this one blows up, it does, uh, uh it just throws the waste everywhere. I don't think it's as bad. I don't know what the one in, I don't know if they, they shopped it or the one in the Achievement Hunter stuff, like, was different. That one, like, exploded. Um, these, uh, hogs are being auto-mined, right? They're not just chilling over here. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, but you have to replace the stupid thing every so often. Yeah, I noticed it wasn't pulling in the mob farm. That's weird. Yeah, you yeah, have to replace that. Who's touching my water? Maybe we should put it on a hopper into a chest and then the chest into the network. The it is. Uh, there is a miner that's connected to. So there's a there's a collector. So there's mm -hmm. the miners and then the collectors. And oh, it should okay. auto be putting it in. And it's already making everything into... It's taking the truffles automatically, making them into... 90%. Whatever it oh, is. That's, that's nice. Yeah. But it's slow. I'm not super happy with the efficiency of it. Just trying to think about what my next 91. project is. Between now and next week. Um, because next week is Ender Dragon, right? Assuming we get fusion running this week. Yeah. We bulk up. Got a 92. Heck oh, yeah. So we are on the brink of greatness. I'll take a look at some of these. 
93. What do you think the best Android upgrades are? Oh, removes nutritional requirements. I kind of don't want that. I like my s'mores. That's great for vein mining. 94. Maybe I'll just focus on getting all of these. Yeah, I've got a majority of them. I haven't figured out how night vision works yet. 95%. I just hate the stupid stepping one. I wish I could turn it off. Yeah. Because they added that in base Minecraft, and it's the most annoying thing. Oh, yeah, because sometimes you are you can't, like, push up against a block to stop. Yeah. Yeah. 96%. Oh, boy, I should probably come over. You Are you ready to put active coolers on? Uh, it'll take a while to build up. That's what they all say. Very if anything excited. is wrong, we can shut it down. 97%. I am very excited. I'm very excited. I've been working on this for like three weeks. 98%. So what do we think fixed this? Was it a combination of me and Zach's extra biofuel? Yeah, it's just the amount of power. Yeah. Because the reactors take 19,200 power, but I didn't think per, about the... Per tick? Huge Per tick, yeah, that's per tick. Okay. Ninety-nine percent. Here we go, gentlemen. Oh my god. Okay, you see, you said I should look through the clear to watch the ignition. Yeah. Uh, hopefully it'll work. Hundred percent, and we. It says a hundred percent, but it's not right. Oh. Ignited. I see it. You hear it too. <gasps> oh, we should probably uh. Wow. So now you'll notice the efficiency will start going up as the temperature rises. I haven't noticed that. It, it hasn't gone up at all. This thing's still... So it only ignites at 8,000. This thing's still heating up. It, see how it immediately... As it turned to plasma? Uh-huh. So, Zach, your battery should be charging now because I, I bet none of this stuff is going to the thing anymore. Yeah, your battery's charging like crazy. Because oh, nothing's fine. going to the fusion yeah, yeah. anymore. Oh, yeah. By the way, I, I'm going to turn it on to my network. I can charge people's inventory. Oh, oh yeah. I've, I've had that here for a while. Oh, you have? Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Ooh, that looks so cool. I want, don't, please don't ac oh, please don't accidentally mine. I know. You remove Nobody. anything. Nobody accidentally vein mines except for you, Will. I didn't accidentally vein mine. I purposely oh, was... vein mined. <laughs> That's worse. And then accidentally. <laughs> no, the server lagged. That's worse. That's not worse. Oh, your your deuterium is that is that a byproduct? Yeah. Should figure out a way to get rid of that. Well, let's ju just do the fluid um the fluid trash can. Hey, well, you're running out of hydrogen. It should be pumping in from these suckers. These are chock full of hydrogen. Yeah, but it's you're not still going out. out. You're at 27 out of 32. I don't know why. Oh, these things aren't powered. Is that maybe why? No, um, they are. Look, these are all full of hydrogen. Are these fluid extraction cable? Oh, they're probably pulling the wrong thing. Yep, yeah, it's just oxygen. You need to right-click on the cables, not on the uh, extraction cables, just on the actual ones. Uh, you can see oh, that. Oh, it's bringing the deuterium back out. Yeah, you uh, you have to set it. <sighs> I forget how I did it over here. Yes, yeah, so we need to change that cable. So that needs to be an input that only inputs hydrogen. Yeah. Well, you can do a filter, right? So yeah, cable? if you can, if you can, if you delete them all and then put them back, they should just have hydrogen in them because that's what your uh, whitelist has. Oh, uh, gotcha. So w while you were building it, st other stuff got in it. Okay, so can you do that? No, I refuse. Yeah, give me a second. <laughs> Just steals all your fluid cables and walks away. <laughs> yeah, because I... Oh, you forgot a couple in here, Zach. Okay. Oh, I have a head, by the way. 
and go display that. Yeah, can I, can you hand those to me? The fluid cables, or did you already put them in? Here they are. Thanks, belly buddy. Keep taking your sniper out, and it's concerning. It's just, it's just where I feel most comfortable. I still, there's a plasma just, shotgun in the computer. Can't take it out. I put it in there when the server was lagging, or when the server was uh, backing up, and now I can't take it out. Okay, oh, hydrogen hey. is spiking back up. Hey, Dingus Head, you what? have you had hydrogen as a blacklist. Oh, I didn't change all of them. Yeah, you are you are full of guacamole, you Dingus. As okay, one of them has a lot of hydrogen now. One of the tanks is full. Looks like the other tank is filling up. So you're good over yeah. here. Should be good. The deuterium is building up slowly, so we have time to deal with it. Do you want to keep it? You can or also you just wanna... shift click to get rid of it. Oh, uh, but I mean, if you can do that, but we also might as well I I I um dump. I have void leftover fluid, so if they fill yeah. to the max, it just destroys the leftovers. Oh, okay. So we are efficiency 0.1%. Um, your hydrogen, I don't know if you're producing enough because it looks like your tanks are jumping up and then down. Yeah, yeah you're losing you hydrogen. You're not, you're not making enough. Oh, this one is... Yeah, this one's not dumping for some reason. Oh, Let there's... me just build some for you. Yeah, if you want to make more. What are these... Electrolyzer. Electrolyzer, advanced plating. Whoa, something just happened. You just gave me a ton. Yeah, uh, it was stuck in this cable right here. Uh, I'm at max on all of them. Nice. Okay. Is it good now? Yeah, we're good. Okay. So, I'm wondering when I should add. I'm going to add the active coolers eventually, but not yet. So we're producing 100 RF per tick now. Mm -hmm. As the temperature rises. Rise. Rise. Temperature rise in my uh, rocket ship. Uh, Zach, so you can reconnect all your stuff. Yeah, I was about to say the Inferium thing need, really needs to be hooked up again. Work. Can I hook up can I just make the network just everything work together now? Yeah, 100%. Okay. Uh, do you have any more resident flux? Uh, I have two. Okay, oh, nope, mind. I have 64. Just stick it back in the network. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's back. Thanks, bud. Eyes, Captain, not eyes. Do you guys happen to know which item has the most, uh, like, matter? If that makes sense? I don't. No, I don't. I wish I could just look that up, you know? Sort by matter. Oh, jeez, it's 136%. Okay. 20. Dump those in there. What else is heavy stuff? Thirty. We have 38. 39,000 silver ingots. Wow. Perfect. Yeah, what's our most thing right now? Most? How do you sort by that, Zach? Uh, sort by amount. Oh. Yeah, we have 568,000 sticks. Was that after I complained we didn't have enough sticks? Yeah. <laughs> Look how much coal stuff we have. 
Yeah, I know. I, I, we had four coal saplings, and I upgraded everything to blue mulch, which just is insane. I and, really uh, like the thought that we have 6k donuts, 8,000 marshmallows. Is there, a way to link, is there a way to link our network to the uh, Twilight Forest? I we don't figure that out. so. Because I'm just going to The closest start thing you can do to it is make a network there that dumps into an ender chest and then put the other ender chest here. Then it wouldn't really... Would that work? It, you could only dump from your network into our network in the overworld. Yeah. Well, I guess I could, I could, if I knew what I wanted, I could have it dump in the homeworld into the ender chest. It's all coming down. Yeah, I don't need all this stuff over here. So, a lot of the stuff, like the sticks, I'm just going to start dumping them, because if they have matter, they'll feed the singularity. Gotcha. All right. Basically, basically a way of trashing it, but that actually helps us. Do you just put it at all in a hopper? Uh, you can do a hopper. You can just manually throw it in. Oh, yeah. I was thinking of just uh, automating. We're at efficiency one percent. We're at five hundred twenty-seven RF per tick. I could Those do a dropper. Powering up. So if we had a trash chest, I'm just trying to think of the best way to do this. Actually, yeah, maybe I'll do that. Let's do something stupid. So, do we have any, do we have an ender chest? We have one. I think there's one of the lost cities. I think I could just craft more real easy because of the blaze statue. Oh, the blaze statue. Gosh, I am so excited this thing is working. Okay. 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 So now we have two ender chests. So I'm going to put one ender chest here. And then I'm going to put a storage export cable with a filter on it. And I'll figure out what I want to do for now. Oh, no, that's not working. Oh, no, can you not? You can't. You can't cable into it, an ender chest. I wonder if I drop onto it. Let me try that. You might have to set an input on the ender chest. How do you set an input? Yeah, where? Let me come up there. Yeah, I'm next to the pooter. Yep. Because it doesn't have a, oh, a the yeah, dialogue. Oh, yeah, you're right. You're right. Yeah, so I was going to just do a dropper because the cable doesn't connect to it. Yeah. That's what I had to do with the loot fabricators. Dang it. This is so very annoying. Um, I, Zach, I don't think I'm getting enough hydrogen anymore. Okay. I've got all those electrolyzers over there. If you can dump them to me. I think yeah, I... Yeah, this is saying deuterium again. Yeah, there may be... Check to make sure there's not one that's doesn't either have a whitelist or... I wonder if it's pulling it from the machine? From the... Yeah, maybe. Yeah, I'm running real low on hydrogen. Okay. Like, as fast as you can get it to me. Uh, yeah, that's gonna take me a second. Oh, I should just give these things speed chips. Yeah. Yeah, nope, it, it stopped. Yeah, that's fine. 
Ooh, lag. Okay. So we want sticks. Really, we don't even want to crush quartz. You're getting water from. What does the offset in the dropper mean? Not sure. Good enough. It's not dropping onto the ender chest. I'm gonna look it up real quick. And a chest dropper. They will not interact with hoppers, droppers, or poppers. Oh no, this thing is hoppers shut down. Pop it. Popper's gonna pop it. You guys need help over there? Just need more hydrogen. The electrolyzers. Well, I need you to make more elite pressurized tubes. How do I do that? I don't know. Figure it out. Here. I'll help. What are these for? I need to make, oh, I made eight more. There you go. Okay. I need many. Okay, I'm making a bunch. Okay. Okay, there's a hundred, 216 for you. Okay, I'm gonna look up cross-dimensional storage. Is that enough, or do you think you need more? I think that might be enough. Oh, I need... I need a water source. I need to go see how I built it over there. Network transmitter. Oops. Oh no. Hi. Hey, hey, stop it. Energy bridge transmitter. someone trying to blow up a balloon near you? What? Do you hear that? Whoever is doing dishes makes it sound like they are trying to blow up a bunch of helium balloons. <laughs> this is really weird. It's okay, nobody's watching. I really love that nobody shows up for Minecraft. Uh, I, I like it because it means like Tuesday is like the main stage, the big event, and Thursday is just, yo, let's hang out. Yeah. yeah. Oh, Ian, um, mm -hmm. can we talk about our um, our post podcasting prospects here? Uh, yeah, let's go ahead. Nobody's, nobody's listening. So I was thinking as far as our mission to Zix clone, mm -hmm. um, I was thinking if we based it around patrons at a inn bar like a an inn or tavern and then yeah. each week the quote unquote special guest was someone traveling through town and it's always us trying to fix something in the town oh well so the only thing is i i like the idea of each episode doesn't necessarily have to but each episode is a new-ish location whereas oh that that's I a good idea too so I was thinking maybe they come in and they tell their story at the end. Yeah. So there's like one or two regulars at the end. 
but there's always somebody new who tells their story and then we transition to the story. So they're like, just last year when the moon was coming in full and the pumpkins ready and ripe. And then we do like, a I don't know, yeah, it, that's an idea. I do like doing fantasy though. Uh, I think it's going up. Okay. Damn, I like how like Will just did this real half-ass setup over here where he's just like, gotcha, I just need hydrogen. And then Zach comes in and builds like just this incredibly optimized thing. Listen, I'm the brainchild. I invent and then you guys no. optimize. No, you're like the child that picks up the shiny new toy and then throws it away. Zach masters the toy. And then I come along and I play with both toys that have now been discarded but are much easier to obtain. Well, Zach, yeah. this pipe can see through my vision fusion reactor. Weird. Oh, yeah. Temperature. Daddy don't like that. Oh. So how's it going over here, by the way? It's going okay. Is it cooling oh, too much? Yeah, yeah, we're back up. Okay. What was, what, oh, is it the hydrogen? There wasn't enough hydrogen? Yeah, I think so. Gotcha. Power's climbing. Well, folks, uh, should we end it? What are you thinking? No. Yeah, we can. Even though I'm going to continue to play. Yeah, I'll I mean, forever. Uh, I think I'm going to continue to play too, so we don't have to end it. Yeah, we don't have to end it. Yeah. It's not like we act any different whether on stream or off stream. Yeah, that's true. Just a lot more fank and profanity, am I right? Whoa, did you like, I sent you a profanity, Ian. I don't know if you liked it or not. Was that the one that I mistook for like a butt text? Yeah, pronk. Oh, pronk's not bad. Pronk's pretty good, right? Pronk's good. Pronk you. Pronk you! Yes, please. Oh, I, I made some oh. healing. You made healing? You made Felt good to say. Okay, man. Right. So now four, we can seven. just burn down all your reactors, Will. FE per tick. Don't touch my reactor. Well, once this thing starts back up again. Oh, that's right. I was going to try and figure out how to do storage. What? Why does that it say can excavate add. shape on my screen? You're holding something that'll excavate. Don't do it on the reactor. Oh, I would laugh so hard. Whew. Uh-oh, whoops. Dimensional transceiver. Yeah, Zach, all my stuff is... All these... No, now it's got some hydrogen. I don't... These just... These, I guess these just aren't producing it fast enough. Yeah. What's a dimensional pylon? Okay, so I don't know what just made this turn back on, but now it's it's still off. Um, I'm sorry. Could you say that again? I don't know what made this turn on, but now it's turning off. Okay, here we go. Sky Factory 4 storage across dimensions. Is that what they're called? It's dimensions? Yeah. yeah. I'd maybe okay. add another one, Zach, I guess. Uh, I'm dumping your oxygen tanks were are full and then it stops making. Oh, mm. is that I didn't realize that. Yeah. I thought it just oh, kept going. Lord.
omnidirectional connector. Can connect to other omnidirectional connectors anywhere, including different dimensions. Okay, let's see. Yep, can't build that. Oh, I can't build that. I don't even know if that's what I want. Okay, yep, okay, yep, yep, okay, here we go. ME Quantum Network Bridge. Oh, back on. I think we're getting enough hydrogen now. Okay, guys, I figured it out. Yeah, I do think one more, Zach. One or two more. Be safe. Yep. Do you want to take the ones from over here? No. Uh, I've got, I've got enough. Okay. You have a bunch of hydrogen. Dang it. Oh, no, back up. Okay. Anything there? I think we're doing a lot better. Whoops. Oh, well. So we dropped 25. Oh, no, it just turned off again. 26. 25, 200. Four two hundred. Twenty three two hundred. Twenty four. Yeah, twenty five. Twenty four. I still think we need more. Okay. Yep, she just turned off again. Do you, what do you need me to do? Do I need to build something? Uh, no, I'm just uh, trying to get this to build as fast as possible. Yikes. Yikes, that didn't work. I tried to build a drawbridge, but it's not working. Okay, so are you are you plugging along over there? Yeah, I think our issue is we're just not getting enough hydrogen. So you need like a big hydrogen farm? Yeah. Okay. Does this need to be a pressurized tube? I think so. Oh, out of the... 
Yeah, I'm confused at why it's filling one tank and not the other. It's like... Well, it's gonna fill one first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it fills one first and then it... Gotcha. And it looks like it is... Yeah, this, this is one's not on. full. Why isn't this on? I don't know. Okay, now it's on. Yeah, I just put 64 speed upgrades into this thing. Nice. Yeah, yeah that's the hydrogen tank's filling up now. Oh, oh, going down. Yeah, I'm watching it too. I can't tell if it where. I, th well, I think I honestly think we're stabilized. I think we need to add another. I don't. Let me... No, I I don't think. I don't think we are. I think we're at a slow deficit. No, because my my electrolytic separators are full. I'm trying to tell. So the top one is hovering around 32. The bottom one is. I I think we're at a deficit because the bottom the bottom one was at like 3,300. Now it's down to dropping down to 850, and now it's at going even lower than that. So it's, I think we're at a very slow deficit. Yeah. It's hard to tell, but I think I'm we are. gonna try and see if I can move this. Maybe you just do like a little bit more speed upgrade or one more electrolytic. Let's there see, we go. Folks. Uh, my tank or my mine was only filling like one of them, so now it's filling both of them. Why is it so hard to tell? <laughs> the pulls four thousand, goes to fifty eight. Yeah, I think, I think we're yeah, at think a we're, we're at now. a gain net gain now. Yeah. Yeah, it's it's a very small gain. I, I wonder if it's gonna need more as it gets higher. What do you think? Yeah, it might. Once I get the efficiency to a hundred percent might be good. Look at that. All right, so how about we call it here? Uh, what's next week? Next week is we verify the final build operational 100% efficiency of the fusion reactor. We defeat the end dragon, and uh, maybe we have a little party. I've got a party planned. I thought for, for a little while, I thought this week was the last week, but we actually have next week, next Thursday, 10 p.m. Eastern. Um, and I have at least a party plan. So maybe each of you could come up with at least one surprise that you're ready to show at the end of next week's stream. How does that sound? Yeah, that's perfect. perfect. Um, but by surprise, I mean, like, don't even tell the other people. Is, oh, I oh did you just explain what a surprise is? Yeah. Did you want to vein mine anything real quick before we leave? I hate you so much. I'll vein mine <laughs> your, your pace. <laughs> Um, okay, well, we are Subpixel. Uh, we stream every Tuesday and Thursday at 10 p.m. Eastern. Uh, you can find our stuff at subpixelfilms.com. That takes you straight to our YouTube page. We also do scan lines every Wednesday, critical analysis pieces uh, every now and then on Mondays, and documentaries probably uh, once every six months, I think, is our average right now. Um, you can also find us on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram at Subpixel Team. And you can find our compatriots. Uh, Zach, where can we find you? Uh, at Hunt271 on Twitter. And Will Crosby, where can we find you? You can find me at Hunt270 on Twitter. Uh, and you can find better. me at Hunt269 on Twitter. Thank you for joining us. Gentlemen, any closing words for our big fat goose egg of zero viewers? Uh, don't uh, put all your uh, eggs in a flower crate. Wow. Uh, Zach, I'm Beautiful. pretty sure you can improve on that one. Um, I'm just saying, Dad, I thought you said you'd watch. <laughs> you mean Stream Mom? No Stream Mom. Okay. Yeah, it's okay. I know I know he'll come back later to watch. Um, yeah. But it's okay. I like that Thursdays are cozy and Tuesdays are busy. Uh, we'll be back this Sunday. 2 p.m. Eastern, Will and I will be streaming more of the Super Mario Maker 2 featuring your levels. Till then, bye-bye. Bye. Bye. -bye. bye.